Welcome to our first Hot PC user video. Today we'll show you how an ordinary dual-core processor can be transformed into a full quad-core CPU with additional cache. This CPU has indeed, according to official specifications, two cores only. These are running with 2.2 GHz and the processor itself has a C2 stepping. But what cores does it have? I mean a code name. We were very surprised with the results of our experiment. After unlocking the CPU with advanced clock calibration function, we've got a powerful CPU with four cores. In order to unlock the CPU, you will need a specific motherboard. In our case, it was a Gigabyte board with AM2 Plus CPU support. Important is revision 2.0, because this one possesses ACC function, supports PC2 memory and is famous for overclocking possibilities. Also, don't forget to update your BIOS. If you get this board with an old BIOS, be sure you have a FG BIOS with core control option. In this case, if you have problems with some unlocked core, you can easily disable this core and you will still get a triple-core CPU with additional cache. It will be still faster as an ordinary dual-core processor. After we've turned on the ACC function, we saw the CPU-Z information. The code name is Deneb. The CPU has four cores. Our operation system Windows XP has recognized four cores correctly as well. We've got a real quad-core processor with all features of top models, such as Phenom 2x4. According to our experiments to undervolting, this CPU could operate at 2.2 GHz and its voltage was 1.2 volts. The system was stable and it was tested with these two programs. Our try to overclock this quad-core CPU was successful. We've reached 3.3 GHz at default voltage. The system was tested once again. It was stable. But what if we'll increase CPU voltage a little bit? We have reached 3.5 GHz and it was very impressive for this processor. Unfortunately, we made no tests for stability check because of the bad cooling. But the system seemed to be stable. We detected no crashes during our experiments. We think that the most users may prefer these optimal options for everyday use. Even if you overclock the CPU up to 3 GHz with default voltage, you will still have a quad-core processor with a lot of power. It's very simple. If you want to find out how lucky you are, you can try to unlock this dual-core Athlon processor and if you get a Deneb-based Athlon, you may get a very powerful CPU. As a bonus! One should remember that there is no guarantee that your CPU can be successfully unlocked. Your system may get unstable or you can damage your hardware. It was just an experiment and we shared our results with other users. For more interesting reviews and experiments, visit our Facebook group Hot PC User.